Hi, I'm Chris Gardner with your tip of the day from Practical Help for your digital life. You can find all my tips on Facebook under Practical Help as well as on my website. If you find my tips useful, please share them with your friends. Today's tip is about what to do if you suspect that your Microsoft Windows PC has been hacked. So how would you know? These days hackers are so sophisticated that they can hack your computer without alerting you and get it to do whatever they want. There's no red flag or alert and you can easily lose everything. All it takes is one inadvertent click of your mouse in the wrong place. So what do you do? Remove the bad stuff. Here's how. Step one is to detect and remove any rootkits. These lurk underneath what you see on screen and aren't detected easily by your standard computer security programs. Here are links to three tools. Just download and run one, two, or all three of them. They're free. Step two is to use a malware scanning tool to find and remove malware, spyware, trojans, and computer viruses from your PC. Here's a powerful and free tool that you can use. Just download and install it, update it, and do a full system scan. Remove anything it finds, restart, and then rinse and repeat until you get a clean scan. Of course, if neither of these steps found anything, you're in great shape. But if they did find something, you also need to boost your PC's security protection, which has probably been compromised. So your last step is to remove whatever protection program you have and replace it with something better. Here's my top-rated computer security program, which you can usually find for much less than the retail price you see on their website. If you can't stand the thought of paying for the best protection, this is my favorite free protection program. Now you Apple Mac users enjoy stronger built-in security, but you're not totally immune to computer threats, and your Mac can be a carrier for PC threats when you share files. So it's worth it to scan your system at least once in a while. Look in the Mac App Store for this app. It's free and can help you make sure that your Mac is clean and stays that way. And lastly, smartphone users. Here's a protection program that you Android users can use. iPhone and iPad users don't yet need to worry about these threats. That's today's tip. If you find my tips useful, please join our member-supported website where you can get tip sheets with written instructions and links to resources I've talked about here. And please share my tips with your friends, or at least give me a like. Thanks for watching.